Okay, this is an update. I um, wanted to show you guys what I've decided to bring on my first fishing trip um, on with my new kayak. Um, I've slimmed it down quite a bit, so um, follow in your advice, Tim. This is all my clothing stuff, so like life jacket, shoes, all that crap. So I'll put that on before I leave. This is not in go uh, storage mode by the way this is just to, for showing you guys what um i decided to end up using so um i'm gonna take this little thing this document as an extra rod um it's hilarious it's a little little guy and i put the old shakespeare spinner thing on there so um that's gonna be my backup rod and then i've got a pin battle um two uh rod that I'll take. Um, I'm, using, I'm going to use plastics. Um, got my phone will stay in this pot. I, what I did was I cut this, the lines on these so I could use this as a big pocket. Um, so I'm going to keep my clippers in there, my measuring tape that won't rust. Um, here, clipped on here, I have a bait knife, which I probably won't need this time around, but because I'm going to use plastics, and then my grippers, um, I'm going to keep my hook larger there, I've got my braid line scissors, my first aid kit hooked on here, um, with my leader, I can retie. Um, I even got one of these, like, identification things, because I'm really still learning my fish. I'm, I'm not an idiot, but still learning, so. Back here, I decided to put a fanny pack. I got my baby wipes, sunglasses, sunscreen, and my fishing license is in the front pocket. Then, I've got my net. Um, what's, what's a good thing to put in here? Um, I've got this cool little compartment. It's waterproof, and I don't know what to put in there. Um, and then I'll put, I'll keep my wheels there. This is my little lantern. I don't know. I may just keep it in the car, depending on what time we go tomorrow. Um, and then this is the only tackle box I'm going to bring. It's just this one. I've slimmed it down quite a bit. So I got my bug spray. Procure my measuring stick thing um, with all the um, min and max requirements on the fish, some plastics, various colors, jig heads, barrel swivers, SPF for my lips, and um, I think I'm ready to go. Oh, and I'm going to keep all my fillet stuff. Like if I actually catch some some fish worth keeping in my crate. So I'm still going to keep my crate, but I'm going to keep that in my car. Thanks for watching. And um, if you have any tips or comments or whatever, please leave them below. I'm learning, so I appreciate any and all advice you can give. Thanks. All right, have a great day. Bye.